there's a werewolf. Maybe it won't be quite so simple. After all, yeah, I've got to cross the bridge. That's the night shelter right there. Okay, let's see what this guy is. Uh, resistant to blood and... Mm. Okay, so... Oh, oh, he saw me. I can't sneak up on him now. Let's go with the shotgun. Rats. Oh, it takes so long to reload. Oh, rats. Oh! Uh-oh. Here too. Oh, blinker! Uh oh. That's not gonna be good. I need to swap out for <sighs> one of the daggers. Let's go with Giselle's because that one's upgraded. Whoa! Uh oh, oh no! Oof. Heal, heal, heal. Oh no! <laughs> he got me from behind. Not fair. Cheater. I need to get the get rid of the blinker. Oh no. Oh shucks. I was gonna try to blood spear him. That was bad timing. Oh, come on! Oops! Uh oh. Uh oh. Stop! Wow, this blinker is really good at just. Oh. Stop. Stop. Honestly. Nice. Okay, got rid of that. Oh. Oh. Yeah, come on. Come on. Whew. Wow. That was bad. But, there's little rats here. So we can get, get our blood reserve back up. I have this thirst for blood. This is despicable. I can't believe I'm doing this. This is despicable. Alright, that's all of them. <clears throat> oh, oh, that's right, they barricaded. There's a hideout there. If I need it. Okay, here's an opportunity to get some blood back and some health if I can be smart about this. Okay. 
Okay. Alright. Got the blinker almost down if I can just... Good. Oh, come on! I was swinging. Oof. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. No! Well, I am no better off <laughs> after all that. Nuts. Where is the blinker's corpse? I don't think I got to loot him. One, two. Oh, three. Yeah, there's nothing. He's got nothing. Okay, so, Sean Hampton. You and me, sir. He is a blinker, and he... I think he's a blinker. And he also... can summon shadows, so... I don't know. We're doing it. Come on. That's what we're here for. Let's do it. It's time for a reckoning, Sean Hampton. There he is. Level 27. Oof. Okay. Oh, he's got a buddy with him. Oh, no. Oh, no, he's outside. Okay. Ooh, do I take care of him first? He's around the side here. I could... I could harvest him. There we go. Yeah, let's do that. Let's be real quiet, and we'll try to stun him. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't do it. No! There we go. <laughs> Okay. Mm, that's it. Okay, now we go and deal with Sean. <sighs> Did I hear a rat? We could use a rat. <coughs> nope. No rats. Unless they're over here. Ooh, I can loot, though. Small key? Oh, this must have been one of the keys from the... One of the uh, Paxson sisters. Maybe this was their tent. Alright. Now let's do this. Stuck behind the. Oh my gosh, they totally uh, trapped me. Wow, that was impressive. Oh! Side. This is there's not much room here. Oh, sit down. That was lucky. All right, rusted key. Ah, uh, wow, we got 8,500 XP now. Woo. All right, rusted key. Let's uh, let's loot Sean's office here and see if. Oh, here's his chest. Nani? Nothing in it. 
Man, I do feel bad though. He he really was trying to do good work here, and uh, it just it all went bad. And then there was this. <laughs> this stuff down here. Alright, 350 shillings and a watery blood... Oh! A brisk blood sample, too. And a sturdy blood sample. <gasps> That's what I used to make a wedding ring? A necklace? Wow! Oh my god, it's still going. Silver watch, cigarette case... Okay, so the water samples are what I use to uh, make serums for myself, so I think what we'll do then is, well, let's check our map, and we'll see the condition of people. So the docks, oh man, we know the docks are in bad shape. Cold, fatigue, and fatigue. Um... They're in the area. Do I have treat? Oops, doodle. Do I have treatments for those? Uh, bronchitis, pneumonia, anemia, fatigue, cold. Yeah, I do. I could. I could get there. Oh, they're all the way over here, though. Well. 172 meters. Um, where am I going? Can't go that way. Can't go that way. I have to go back this way. She's she's nearby, but I can't do neuralgia. All right, we'll do what we can do, and then we'll go to a hideout. That's the word for it. Yeah, I think we gotta leap across the river here. Oop, I heard rats. Is there a hideout around here? I can't believe I'm doing this. I have this thirst for blood. This is good. How are these two doing? They're good. She's healthy. Where's your BFF? What are you shooting at, even? You're just shooting into this window? Oh, must look a fo <laughs> you again. What do you want? Uh, dude. Oh, wow. There's all kinds of stuff here. Tell me about the man you killed, Booth. What happened? One of us had been killed, so we had to retaliate. That's the whole story. There has to be more to it than that. No, really. One of us got killed, so the killer had to die. That's how things have always been done round here. No one gives a shit. Are you so heartless that you could pull the trigger and kill someone without even blinking? Have you looked around recently? Do you really think one more body will make a difference? Well... 
I know you believe monsters are real, Booth. They are. I know, I saw one, but no one believes me. I am one. Tell me what you saw. It was a few years ago. Clay Cox was still the boss then. He'd sent me to the shipyard to find out who was stealing tools and ropes at night. Go on. First, I thought it was an old lady with a limp. It looked frail and crooked. Then I saw it grab a bloody beam and lift it like it was a stick. I shouted. It, it looked straight at me. Do you know what it was? It was all eyes and long teeth, but I, I, could, I couldn't see its face. I shot at it when it moved towards me and I hit it. And then it jumped and vanished in the shadows. You could have imagined all that. These docks can be so gloomy at night. <laughs> With the fog and the wind and the boats creaking? Yeah. No, Doctor. Good story, Doc. That night, I saw the fucking sewer dog for real. It's not a beast, like the stories say. It's the ghost of an old woman. Bullets can't stop it. But no one believes me. I secretly believe you, Booth. Are your friends mocking you? Even if Weena told me once to never speak about it, but I know what I saw. And it wasn't a human. Not human at all. Yeah, it's just old Bridget. She's harmless. Do you know Edwina suspects you to be unfaithful? Edwina's the one who asked to be called Mrs. Cox, even though Clay hadn't touched her for such a long time. You have not answered my question. She's a passionate woman. I've no doubt she'll shoot me down if I ever betray her, but that's not going to happen. I love her as she is. Isn't that sweet? Have you heard anything about Sean Hampton's shelter? It used to be a safe place. I'm not sure that's the case anymore. <laughs> well, it's pretty empty now. All right, let's do you give need this medical medicine. help, sir? Yeah, I do. If you can throw in some drugs, I can find use for that too. No. So you can sell them on the black market. Sorry, I'll only provide you with exactly what you need. Fair enough, Doctor Reed. Don't cost me nothing to ask. All right. Goodbye. Mr. Digby. We're out of here. Who else needed treatment? Archer Woodbead and Throgmorton. Both are fatigued. Uh, Woodbead was hanging around the docks. Well, this is the docks district, so I guess they're all hanging around docks at some point. He's over there, I think. Ooh, way on the other side. And there's nothing there. Okay. Really wish I could turn into a bat. And just fly across. Where is where is Throgmorton though? Seriously. I haven't seen him in so long. Where's Woodbead? Okay. Good. Get that one sorted. Good evening, Mr. Woodbead. Good evening to you, my young doctor. Uh, anything to talk about? No, sir. Let's Do just... you need my medical attention, sir? Unfortunately, yes. The spirit is willing, but the flesh, well, you know. <laughs> Nobody is immune to disease. There's no need to be ashamed of that. Well, thank you, Doctor. Now maybe I'll live another day or two. <laughs> Goodbye, sir. Okay, now we just need Ichabod. And I really don't know... The wet boot boy. ...where he could be. I sense no heartbeats, except for his. Uh, oh, you know where he might be? Oh, man. I would have to go back, I think. Oh, I don't even remember where it was now. Where The place he sent me to pick up his... His posters. I don't have any memory of where that was. But that's probably where he is. 
I'm guessing. Wasn't there a... Gosh, there was like a market or something. Not this one, though. Hmm. Well, we've got to head this direction anyway, so we'll just we'll just go like over here. <laughs> oh, there's no pre ones up here now. There used to be. Yeah, they've moved on. All the oh, oh, there they are down there. Hmm. Well, this is obviously a combat area, so I'm not going to find a citizen walking around. I don't think. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. They're all high level. Alright, I'll take him. We'll go with this guy. Hey man, there's a bunch of skulls over there. You might want to do something about it. Crossbow guy around? Oh! What am I hearing? Oh, this combat. Oh, there's a, a Ekon. What are they fighting? It's just smoke. Okay, well, anyway, we don't want any part of that. <laughs> we're gonna go we're gonna scurry elsewhere. Good luck to you. Okay. Yeah, this is not... This is back at the... Night Shelter. And I know there's a... a hideout here. This isn't anything. This is despicable. Hmm. There was... Oh, this is it! Okay, yeah, because there's the... These are the fires. Here's that upholstered chair I was appalled at, just sitting in the rain. Okay, but no Ichabod. Oh! There he is! Hey! I was right! Hey, man. Ichabod Throgmorton. Get up. Boots. Good evening, Mr. Throgmorton. Dr. Reed, can I be of any assistance? Have you noticed anything suspicious lately? Do you need my medical attention, sir? Actually, I may. In my line of work, I have to stop at any sign of infection. Treating a vampire hunter's wounds is certainly a first for me. <laughs> I'm happy to help you, of course. Thank you, Dr. Reed. Your support means a lot. Okay, now, do we have any new chatterbox options for him? No, we do not. Alright, off we go. And good hunting, Mr. Throckmorton. I hope they'll all return. That is that. So, that's everybody I can possibly treat. Oh, except for her. Yeah, that's everyone I can possibly treat except for uh, her who needs a headache med medication, which I don't know how to make. Don't understand why uh, why headache, migraine, and neuralgia is like, the one thing I can't I can't treat. But uh, we're gonna head. Well, we're gonna head to here. We need this. We need the hideout. I wish I could get through here now. Now that we've dealt with the 
night shelter problem. That's okay. We'll just hop up here. We will hop inside. Alright, where is our workshop desk? Yaw. What? I thought I picked up some stuff to analyze. Apparently not. Alright, so I don't need any sepsis cures. Oh, I do have a migraine and a headache. Oh, okay, well. Uh, I don't actually need to make any of these because I don't know anybody who actually is afflicted. So, what should we do? Let's see if we can upgrade the hacksaw. We cannot. Oh, one good handle part. Rats. Let's check the good dagger. Yeah, that we can upgrade a couple times. So if we go with... Uh, blood, this would be... Upgrade, and again... Oh, this would be five points. Which makes it better than Giselle's dagger, which is 12. Wait. Absorb five blood points when the weapon hits. What happened? Didn't I... What happened there? I've got the... I've got both upgrades. But it stayed at 10. Uh, I'm a little bit lost there. I think... I think I goofed something up there. Well... Anyway. This is the important part. All right. Blood capacity. I feel like we probably need to boost that a bit. Still don't use blood cauldron much. Bite. So plus fifteen percent to heal when you use bite. Okay, good. And we could do twenty percent. What's the other option over here? Damage inflicted. Okay, yeah, because right now biting doesn't do much damage. I'm kind of using it as a as a healing option. So we could continue to do that. Another thousand to get it up to twenty five percent. Let's see about these though. 4,500. Wow. The shadow explosion has increased range and damage. Okay, that's good. Definitely need that. That gets us up to level 22. I need 6,000 points to increase it to its max. Uh, let's see about Blood Spear. 4,500. Okay, so can't do Blood Spear. About our healing ability. 2700. Oh, we're just shy. Oh, rats. Okay, well, then we'll hold on to those points. And we will just 
confirm and move the day forward. See what happens to those districts. Okay. The docks is up to Sirius. That's good. We've only got... Oh, uh-oh. Merchants' actions have impacted the borough's economy. Merchants' actions? Your actions! Merchants, your actions have affected the good grief. Alright, so Rodney's got a cold now. She's still suffering. But nobody else got sick there, so let's check out the other districts here. Oh. Healthy, so that's actually down from what it was. Clay is fatigued. We still have a headache for her, neuralgia for him. Whitechapel. Excellent. Okay, well, Darius is ill now. We really need to get neuralgia solved because that's causing a lot of problems. I, I feel like this would be probably stable otherwise. Because he's just got a cold and he's the only other one who's ill. And we don't know about anybody else here, except we know that Clarence has a migraine. Alright. Alright, we are up to level 2. Now we're gonna probably head back to the West End and continue that investigation. Uh, but we'll do that next time. Thanks so much for joining me for this episode of Vampire. Hope you're having a great day. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.